Hello Android users. Today I'm going to show you how to run Diablo 3 on your tablet device with Android. I'm running Cyanogen Mod 9 here on my HP touchpad. First off, you're going to need the Splashtop software for your Android device and the Splashtop software running on your PC. Once you have it running on your PC, you can start it up on your Android device. And here you go. Now right off you'll notice it looks a little funny because you're going to need to play around with the resolution. I'm running the Splashtop HD program this time. And here I'll need to drop my resolution down to 1024 by 768 for my device. And that looks a little better. Here you can see my characters. Let's try the monk. Also got a wizard. And this seems to work reasonably well. Let's just change it. Now I'm running this from my PC, a powerful PC with an NVIDIA graphics card, which you'll need to use in order to run the Splashtop APK and stream it. As you can see, it runs reasonably well. There's my equipment. You can join me online for a little Diablo action if you like. I'm Roland DeShane. 79. I'm going to show you a little bit of the gameplay. Now you will run into some hiccuping and some lagging. Now it's pretty neat to play it like this. really quite a playable experience. Get enough of that cow.
I don't have enough spirit. You can try this out for yourself. I've also been able to run Skyrim and Battlefield 3 on my Android device, my HP touchpad, with Cyanogen Mod 9. With the most recent Wi-Fi driver improvement, I found it actually runs a little bit smoother. Any joy I might have had is replaced with sorrow. Upwards, we must make it to the summit. Spoiler alert. And you can run the video playback, the gameplay, everything pretty decently. Anyways, there you have it. Diablo 3, running on the HP touchpad with Cyanogen Mod 9. Keep on the lookout for my Diablo 1 video. You can check it out running that on your HP touchpad as well. Anyways, thanks for watching.